So Stefan, these days people are starting to mention the name Ascals once again. And you having represented the country for so many years in the past, how does that make you feel? Well, uh, it fills me with pride. I'm, I'm happy like many others that um, the name Ascals will be used again for football. Mm -hmm. uh, I think over the years it became uh, handshake football and the Ascals went, went hand in hand. Yeah and uh, brought the sport up. Mm -hmm. And this is not the same as how it used to be before because this is a different game. It's seven, seven aside. Okay. So just for the casual football fan, how would you describe the differences in terms of the actual football and the sevens? Well, uh, the sevens is one of the fastest growing sports. Uh, I think after paddle in the Philippines. Um, in 14 cities now, um, seven, eight, nine, ten countries. I think Anton brought it already, mm -hmm. and it, it's great. It's great yeah. to see that people love the sport that Anton created, and the sevens is the home for it. And for overall, we are we are excited and happy that a the Ascals are back, and b that we can be part of of be sort of like a new. Uh, new history, I would yep. say, almost. And you're going to be co-captaining this Philippine team along with Misa, correct? Well, I'm the captain. Misa will be the co-captain. <laughs> <laughs> but for sure, you're, you're going to be playing here. All right, yes. you're having tryouts now. So uh, how proud are you that, you know, this is a new generation of footballers and, you know, you're leading now in a different capacity. Well, for me personally, it's it's massive because um, when I came over from Germany playing for the Ascals, mm -hmm. um, it was for two reasons: one, to to pay back and say thank you, sort of, to my mom, she's Filipina. Mm -hmm. She brought me up alone, and then B is to inspire and uh, to help Philippine football grow, growing. And um, I think I'm blessed, very blessed, in in a more advanced age to be part for a second time in in a new sport or in a new sort of game for football uh, to help inspire the people again and that's uh, that's beyond blessed. Did you ever think before that maybe your time as a footballer was done, that that chapter was closed? Yeah, many times. I actually, this year, or just recently, I retired from 11 side football. Mm -hmm. And sevens. And for me, it's great to extend the, the football playing because you can retire uh, the part of going every day to training, but you cannot retire the hunger and the passion for it. So, uh, for my last question, uh, you talked about the hunger. Just for all of your fans who have been supporting you throughout the years, Stefan Schrock, or as they famously call you, Schrocky. How hungry is the Shraki to bring back glory as a member of this reincarnated version of the Astros? Well, for me, I'm always hungry. Um, I just recently started playing futsal, uh, so I want to learn and uh, become the best version of myself in futsal. The same goes for the sevens. I participated in the Super Sevens, uh, which is sort of the professional league in, in the seven aside. And for me, winning is, is uh, the most important. So I'm very hungry, very driven, still passionate, and uh, looking forward so much to, to this tournament and to start the preparations. All right, Misa, you guys are forming a new Askel squad, and Shrop just told me that he's the captain and you can be the co-captain. Your reaction to that? Of course, um, it's a fantastic, it's amazing to be going back to Ascals again. And then since I was 19 years old, I was the captain of Philippine futsal teams. So now I was also the captain of the, my club's Global FC. We've been champions several years straight. So being a captain is a, something that we used to be, do. And then of course, Trophy is oldest. We have to respect the age and everything. So he's handling the captain. I will be the co-captain. Okay, Misa, we have a lot of people trying out here for the new team. What are some of the qualities that you're looking for with regards to the selection of the players? Uh, of course, uh, this is uh, the second time we are doing having an international sevens outside the Philippines. So we are looking for players who are quick in their feet. They're like a street football players. Mm -hmm. Like they've been playing in their background for backyard for a long time. Yeah. So we need someone who knows how to release the ball fast and then he just 
quick decision. So sevens and futsal almost is the same. So you need to be so fast with your feet and make decision faster. And you, ha you can have sub every two minutes or every time it's unlimited like a basketball. So you have to go in, give 100%, even for one minute, two minutes, and come in, get uh, some air, and then go back again, you know? When was the last time you represented the Asgals in an international competition? Uh, actually, uh, it was, I think, 2019, but 2018 was also yes. the time that we uh, bring the Philippines to Asian Cup. Okay. So yeah. we were, uh, the last match we played where Phil Young husband scored the penalty, and then we won all those glory days, which was an amazing time. So now you get a chance to bring back those glory days. How does it feel for you personally to come back in a different form? Uh, because of uh, my Achilles injury, I was retired. I stopped for almost four or five years. But when I heard that yeah. there is something like sevens coming up with the Oscars, I got so motivated, I got so excited. that Oscar is about all about art. Yeah. You know, we are going there, fight before for our country. It doesn't matter it's 11 aside or 7 aside. Representing the national, as you know, Oscar means a street dog. Like we come in, we fight, it doesn't matter with food or without food, we do our 100% for our country. So I hope we, Oscars, can bring this mentality back to this, created to this new generation. Dan, the Askel's name is buzzing again. Football is buzzing again. It feels like it's like we're back in the 2010s. How proud are you that the Askel is making somewhat of a reincarnation and a comeback? When, you know, when it comes to football, you know, you know me. After all these years, uh, being involved in football has always been what has uh, kept me away from work <laughs> and family. But uh, Happily, yes. And uh, I think uh, with this chance to compete for the country mm -hmm. through the Asian Sevens, uh, it's a good chance for the Ascal's name to be revived. Just for people to know that we will always be here for football and to help football. Stefan Schrock and Misa Bandora, two people who have represented the Ascal's in the past, are back in a different capacity captain and co-captain of this team, how proud are you that they have stepped up to carry flag and country once again? I think it has never, it, you know, it has never diminished their, their desire and eagerness to represent the country. It has always been there. And uh, of course, they have to be more realistic. They're a bit older now and uh, they don't play as competitively as before. But I think uh, this is a good chance for them. And now they're really stepping up every day. Every day they're working out. Lastly, boss Dan, we all know this. You're always there to support Philippine football and of course the Ascals. But what are the expectations for the first tournament of this new edition of Ascals in the sevens? Yeah, you know, Anton, uh, when we join a tournament, yeah. Uh, we always try to go for uh, the, the wins and the, the title. So um, while, while the players are doing their job and training, then I do my job as well to make sure that we can represent the country properly and uh, Manalo. So we're going for the win, of course, All right. like before. I love the spirit. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank you very man. much.